Welcome back to another episode of LTO My Goodness. I'm your host Lizzie, and today I have Shane, who Hi. you've seen a few times. And we have a new person today, Ellen. Hey. And we're here at Air Power Cafe, checking out their paninis. If you don't know how to get to Air Power, because uh, I'm fairly new, basically, if you just go like you're going to the passenger terminal, and take the really scenic route, like just drive and drive and drive and drive, you'll end up here, and it's definitely worth it. Yeah. It's a, it's a hidden line. little gym. I, I've, I've not eaten here before, but it's really nice in here. It like, is, it's yeah. A, they have like quite a few things here. They have a coffee bar and they serve Starbucks menu items. So they have a you know, Pac-Man machine. Coffee. Oh yeah, free coffee, <laughs> uh, Pac-Man machine. <laughs> and then they serve breakfast items here as well. Because they're open. From 6 a.m. to 2 p.m. It's building 3522, by the way, since it's a bit back here. And the theme for today's show is definitely paninis. I've got the barbecue chicken panini, got uh, bacon, cheddar cheese, all my favorites. I have the Italian panini with provolone cheese, a grilled chicken breast, and pesto. And I have the cordon bleu panini, which has ham, chicken, and Swiss cheese. <laughs> so are we ready to dig in? Yeah, let's go ahead. So mine definitely has that classic cordon bleu taste with the Swiss cheese and the ham and then the ciabatta bread bringing it all together with the herbs. I think mine, um, Italian, I mean it definitely tastes Italian. The pesto, I did go to Italy for a little bit and I pretty much lived on bread and pesto so this is just all the good memories. <laughs> um, but the bread, like she mentioned, the herbs are really good. They really come through and it's a really chewy bread. And I love bread, I could talk about bread all day. But <laughs> it's really chewy, which I really enjoy. The barbecue one has a lot of like classic flavors. It's got nice barbecue sauce, the cheddar cheese, the bacon, all of those really come together. And again, the bread, I think we all have the same exact kind of bread, but this bread is really just the Yeah, I could just eat the bread by itself, yeah. honestly. <laughs> So we did have another option today because they have uh, daily specials. They're doing like Monday through Friday daily specials. They're only open Monday through Friday. Just FYI, don't come on the weekend. Yeah. You'll be sad. Uh, they do have Monday through Friday specials. Today was spaghetti. Spaghetti, and it looked really good on the picture. Yeah. I was tempted. It was like two meatballs, garlic bread, a drink for like a pretty great price. Yeah. So something else to keep in mind. And we know that like since it's next to the flight line, all you flight line people are busy, so if you need a quick meal, just come by Air Power Cafe, grab your meal, and it's definitely very know. conveniently located it for is. for active duty out here, mm -hmm. and it's worth the drive even if you're not. Yeah. To bring it back to the paninis, did you know paninis are Italian? They were first discovered in a cookbook there in the 16th century, and then for some reason in the U.S. they became super popular. One more fun fact, did you also know there is a linguist by the last name of Panini, oh. and he is responsible uh, for creating the grammar of Sanskrit. Oh. I know. Wow. All right, so what do you, get, what do you think, guys? I think it's two thumbs up two for thumbs me. Two thumbs up for me, too. Two for me. Six. Six, yeah, yeah. six. Six thumbs <laughs> yeah. up. One, two, three. <laughs> and in the meantime, stay, stay on, 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 on your friends. friends.